Morning folks, this is Kerry from 401k Dexters. Up here at the property, just threw out a few cattle cubes. We got Teddy there, with the little nub horns. Dorothy, she's looking full. Small steer. Cracking the bull here. Got a big belly. Hey, crack. What are you up to, buddy? They all came running out of the bottom over there where I have the uh, deer camera. They were lounging in the shade. This uh, winter paddock really has put some weight on them. They look good. Filled out. Of course, the winter coat that they're putting on doesn't hurt either. We're out here filling water tanks. I've got a uh, spot in the fence over here. Oh, honey, remind me to pick up the uh, horse takeouts. Oh, okay. Thank you. I've got a spot over here when we were working on the fence that got caught on the hitch. And when I started pulling off, it pulled out and kind of loosened stuff. So I'm going to tighten that up. I'm going to fill up the water. Throw some more cubes for the Dexter cows. And this little stray that wandered up. Teddy, we took him down and had him steered. So he wouldn't get a hold of any of the heifers. Or Kiki there with the horns. So trying to keep the Dexters pure. Looking forward to when they all mature enough to breed. As you can see, that's about a 47 inch fence right there. And they're about 10 inches shy of it. Kiki is probably about three inches shy of it. So she's about 45 inches at the shoulder. This is the biggest steer here. He'll be going to freezer camp first. And good riddance because he's the one with the biggest attitude. But, checking in here at the homestead, getting little projects done, enjoying the beautiful weather. It's supposed to be in the 60s all week. Looks like they still have plenty of grass here in this northeast paddock. I meant to mention that when the last time we were out here working all day long, we were sitting there in the camper right there. And we had come out and stood right where Belinda is and looked south here and saw the most beautiful red fox run across the property. It was just the brightest, deepest red auburn with a white-tipped tail. And the tail was probably a good three, three and a half feet long. But uh, it came from down near the cow port over there and uh, squatted looked right at us squatted and did its business and then it wandered off towards this down tree over here so just some neat wildlife out here on the property just beautiful we've got a nest over in one of those trees there of uh, hawks there was one flying out here oh there he is above the trees just screaming the other day everybody know that he was out here and it was his area to hunt all right we'll let you go 401k dexters out